what am I most excited about? Being in Naples for the first time. Um, straight to bed after dinner. We waited for like an hour for our table. It was crazy. And then we left at like 11.30 and there was still that big crowd. Anyways, we were headed downstairs to find a cafe for breakfast because <laughs> um, I need some coffee, some Neapolitan coffee, which I heard is like the best. Let's go. <laughs> Last night we stayed in a B&B &B, like in the city center um, because this hotel was sold out and Emilio is working in this hotel this weekend um, and it's a little outside of the city but the views are worth it. I could stay on this terrace all day. Oh, it's such a beautiful day and I don't, I don't mind the view. Oh yeah, so as you saw, we had breakfast, uh, these famous Neapolitan style pastries called sfogliatella and we had iced coffee, so good, oh my god, but I'm really full, it was such a heavy breakfast, but when in Napoli, anyways, right behind me is Mount Vesuvius, which is really cool, and this is the volcano that actually destroyed the city of Pompeii. You didn't know that very interesting and right behind like this window is Capri it's like a 30 minute ferry ride it's beautiful what do you guys think cheers 
salute! Il dolce far niente. Prosecco at noon. I like, I like Napoli on me. Good morning! It's 10 a.m. I woke up like an hour ago. I just got downstairs from having breakfast since it closes like now. Um, and it's another beautiful day. Emilio is working all day. So I am going to go in the city center. Oh, I think there's like a funicular that takes you down into like, I don't know. I'm gonna have to figure it out and explore. <sighs> so I'm going to fix myself because I'm practically still wearing pajamas and venture outside. The view that we have uh, from the hotel, but Naples city center is there in, in the middle. So wish me luck I'm trying to figure out how to get down there. <laughs> along the, the sea, the Lungomare, um, but it says it's going to be an hour walk. I think I'm going to walk. It's really nice, but it's really hot. I'm going to dress and I'm like drenched in sweat already. This local told me to take this certain bus and I haven't seen it pass by, so. <laughs> fun run and I like walk into in like in the dress and I'm like scoozy scoozy oh embarrassing <laughs> recently to the hotel room by taxi because this, the hotel is very far walking distance and I just walked and explored I wanted to find apparently Naples has like an underground like ancient Naples but I didn't find it and instead of using a map like a normal smart tourist per traveler person I was like no I'll get lost I'll just keep turning down alleyways and I'll figure it out um, so I walked until I couldn't feel my legs 
and I did some damage in keels because I did, I, I am out of SPF daily face moisturizer and I needed an air conditioned, air conditioned environment. I saw keels and I was like, yes! So the, the ladies there were amazing and they helped me get what I needed. I'm not used to walking that much. But anyways, it was nice. It was a very hot day. Funny story. So this dress ties, okay? It's like, it ties and you open and there's like another tie. I didn't realize at one point that it had untied while I was walking. And a big gust of wind comes and like opens up the entire dress where you can literally see my leg from my foot all the way up to like my bra, like with my underwear. And there was a group of guys, like guys speaking in Neapolitan, so I don't understand that. And they were like doing, I don't even know what they said, but I was mortified and embarrassed. And I like, it was like a Marilyn Mon Monroe moment, but not intended. Um, and I immediately like turned the corner. Oh, that was mortifying. And I definitely got some sun. Shoot, I just now noticed that. I hate when like the nose is red and then you have the panda eyes from your sunglasses. Oh no, I even put SPF on. I have a risen. And that highlight though, or it could be sweat. <laughs> um, anyways, I'm headed out for drinks and a pizza. Whew, I don't know if this tummy can handle it, but let's go.